I spoke to Representative Kathy Castor tonight just minutes before Congress reconvened. And despite that chaotic scene unfolding at the Capitol today, she tells me that tonight it was absolutely critical. They got back to work. Thank you very much. Thank you. Soon to be Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer returns to the Capitol, thanking law enforcement after one of the darkest days in American history. These are domestic terrorists. They're, they're not protesters, they're not rioters, they're domestic terrorists that have attacked our United States Capitol, the People's House. U.S. Representative Kathy Castor inside her office when rioters breached the Capitol. Hours after that violent uprising, the Tampa Democrat ready to finish the job. I'm more determined than ever uh, to make sure that uh, we follow the Constitution, that we don't let a racist mob determine our elections, that we make sure the voice of the people across America is heard and effectuated. So. Amid the chaos, a Capitol staffer rescues the Electoral College ballots. Senator Jeff Merkley, confident those were a target. Thank God we had some uh, brilliant professional staff uh, on hand to, to know the importance of grabbing those boxes. Florida politicians statewide eager to get back to work at the Capitol tonight. Senator Rick Scott stating in part the thugs who stormed the Capitol today incited violence should be arrested and prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Thank you, he goes on to say to the Capitol Police for your bravery today. Reporting in Tampa, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.